Military technology, once the stuff of science fiction, is now very much a part of reality for soldiers on today's battlefields. Modern advancements have brought forth next generation tools that significantly enhance the effectiveness of soldiers, allowing them to fight and win in increasingly complex environments. One of the most groundbreaking developments in this regard is the Integrated Visual Augmentation System, or IVAS, which has become a game changer in how soldiers perceive their surroundings and engage in combat. Recently, the U.S. Army reached a significant milestone by receiving the first 20 prototypes of the IVAS 1.2 variant. This event marks a major step forward in equipping soldiers with cutting-edge situational awareness technology, directly impacting their preparedness and performance in combat. The IVAS system is designed to ensure that soldiers have the most advanced tools at their disposal, enhancing their ability to respond to the rapidly evolving demands of modern warfare. The IVAS 1.2 variant is part of a broader initiative managed by the Program Executive Office Soldier, with the Project Manager Soldier Warrior Office playing a key role in its development. This office oversees the creation and deployment of IVAS, ensuring that it meets the high standards required for military operations. The goal is simple yet ambitious, to provide soldiers with a technology that not only meets their current needs, but also anticipates future challenges on the battlefield. Microsoft, a key partner in this endeavor, delivered the 20 prototypes to the U.S. Army. This collaboration between Microsoft and the Army has been ongoing since March 2021, when the Army awarded Microsoft a production agreement under the Other Transaction Authority. This agreement allowed Microsoft to manufacture the IVAS with the understanding that the system would be developed iteratively, improving over time based on feedback from soldiers and the results of various tests. The latest task order given to Microsoft in December 2022 reflects the Army's commitment to continuously refining and enhancing the system. What sets the IVAS apart is its ability to integrate multiple capabilities into a single device. It's not just a piece of equipment, it's a comprehensive solution that combines an all-weather fighting goggle with a mixed-reality heads-up display. This system incorporates next-generation situational awareness tools, giving soldiers a significant edge in both mobility and lethality, regardless of whether they are operating during the day or night. Beyond its combat applications, the IVAS is also designed to support training and rehearsal activities. This integration means that soldiers can use the same device to train, rehearse, and fight, providing a seamless transition between different aspects of military preparation and execution. This all-in-one approach is a significant advancement enabling soldiers to be better prepared and more adaptable in the field. Colonel Anthony Gibbs, who leads the Project Manager Soldier Warrior Office, has emphasized how transformative the IVAS program is for the Army. Reflecting on the development process, Colonel Gibbs noted that the operational tests conducted with the earlier version 1.0 of the system provided crucial insights. The feedback from soldiers who used the system in real-world scenarios was invaluable, leading to significant improvements that are now realized in the 1.2 variant. The system is specifically designed for soldiers engaged in dismounted close combat. This means it's tailored to the needs of soldiers who are often on foot operating in challenging environments where every advantage counts. The system enhances situational awareness, lethality, survivability, and maneuverability, essential elements for soldiers in close combat. One of the system's key features is its ability to integrate various technologies into one device, simplifying the gear soldiers need to carry while vastly expanding their operational capabilities. One of the most impressive aspects of the IVAS is its expanded field of view. The system gives soldiers a field of view nearly twice as wide as current systems, significantly improving their ability to navigate and identify targets. Additionally, the IVAS includes passive target interrogation capabilities. This means soldiers can detect and identify targets without giving away their position to the enemy, a critical advantage in maintaining the element of surprise and ensuring operational security. The system also integrates seamlessly with ground and air platform sensors, giving soldiers a comprehensive understanding of their surroundings. For instance, soldiers can use the IVAS to see outside their vehicles before dismounting, 
helping them avoid potentially hazardous situations. The system supports 3D mapping and navigation, crucial for planning and executing missions in complex terrains. These features collectively make the IVAS an indispensable tool for modern soldiers, enhancing their ability to perform effectively in a wide range of environments. In addition to its combat capabilities, the IVAS complements existing systems within the Army's inventory. It significantly expands the capabilities of close combat forces by leveraging a digital architecture that supports shared awareness and real-time computing at the edge of operations. This means soldiers can process and act on information as it becomes available, giving them a significant advantage in fast-paced combat scenarios. The first-person augmented reality perspective provided by the IVAS integrates operational data directly into the soldier's field of view, offering crucial information at a glance. Another standout feature of the system is its built-in training tool, the Squad Immersive Virtual Trainer. This tool provides soldiers with realistic scenarios and battle drills using holographic and mixed reality imagery. The SIVT allows units to train their squads with minimal resources, ensuring that soldiers are well prepared for any mission they might encounter. This flexibility in training is essential as it ensures the soldiers are constantly honing their skills and staying sharp even in between deployments. The program has seen several iterations, with each version building on the strengths of its predecessor. The 1.0 provided a solid foundation with baseline warfighter capabilities, while the 1.1 introduced an improved low-light sensor that aids in maneuvering and target identification. The latest version, IVAS 1.2, includes several critical improvements. It features a new form factor designed to address human systems integration, including physiological impacts identified during testing. This version also boasts a lower profile HUD with a distributed counterweight, improving comfort and usability for soldiers in the field. Furthermore, the 1.2 includes software enhancements that increase the system's reliability and reduce its power consumption. These improvements address some of the challenges identified in earlier versions and make the system more practical for extended use in the field. The new form factor also includes a mechanism that allows the device to be attached to a combat helmet with a hinge display, similar to traditional night vision goggles. This design allows soldiers to easily raise and lower the display, adding to the system's overall convenience and functionality. While earlier versions of the IVAS, such as 1.0 and 1.1, will be primarily used for training purposes, the close combat forces will be equipped with a 1.2 variant. This strategy ensures that soldiers receive the most advanced technology for real-world operations while still benefiting from the foundational capabilities provided by the earlier versions during training. By rolling out these versions in a staggered manner, the Army ensures that all units are equipped with the appropriate tools for their specific needs. Colonel Gibbs has spoken about the transformative potential of the system, noting that even the earlier versions demonstrated a significant leap in capability. With the introduction of IVAS 1.2, the system is expected to further enhance this potential, providing soldiers with the situational awareness and advanced capabilities needed to maintain a strategic edge on the battlefield. The upcoming user assessment, scheduled for August, will be a critical moment for the 1.2 variant. During this assessment, two squads of soldiers will use the system to measure its performance, ensuring that it meets the Army's rigorous standards and that engineering efforts are on track. The feedback from this assessment will play a crucial role in refining the system further and ensuring it is ready for widespread deployment. The IVAS program is a testament to the Army's commitment to innovation and its dedication to providing soldiers with the best possible tools. The development of the system has involved extensive training and feedback, with over 30 soldier test events and more than 100 technical subtests conducted. This rigorous testing process which involved over 1,000 soldiers contributing nearly 100,000 hours of user feedback, has been crucial in validating the system's progress and identifying areas for improvement. The Army's partnership with Microsoft has been key to the rapid development and refinement of the IVAS system. By adopting an iterative development process that incorporates soldier feedback at every stage, the Army has been able to field a substantial capability much faster than traditional acquisition programs would allow. This approach reflects the Army's commitment to staying ahead of the curve and ensuring that soldiers have the tools they need to succeed.
As the program continues to evolve, it is clear that this technology represents a significant leap forward in military capability. The integration of next-generation situational awareness tools into a single, versatile device is a game-changer for soldiers, giving them the edge they need to navigate the complexities of modern warfare. With the 1.2 variant now in the hands of soldiers, the Army is well on its way to revolutionizing how it conducts operations, ensuring that its forces are always prepared, adaptable, and ahead of the competition. The IVAS initiative highlights the Army's forward-thinking approach to equipping its forces. The proactive strategy is essential as the nature of warfare continues to change. With an increasing emphasis on digital integration, real-time data processing, and augmented reality, by embracing these technological advancements, the Army is not only enhancing the effectiveness of its soldiers, but also setting a new standard for military operations in the 21st century. Ultimately, the IVAS system, with its advanced features and user-centered design, exemplifies how the Army is leveraging technology to meet the demands of modern combat. The ongoing development and refinement of the platform underscore the importance of continuous innovation in maintaining a competitive edge. As the program progresses, the IVAS will undoubtedly play a pivotal role in shaping the future of warfare, providing soldiers with the tools they need to navigate the complexities of the battlefield.